Hey YouTube and welcome to my channel. I know most of you are new here so I first want to say thank you guys for coming and watching this video and as the title say this video is going to be a what's in my book bag pre-nursing haul. So this semester is my um, last prerequisite semester for me to apply to nursing school so I thought I'd show you guys what I'm carrying in my book bag this semester and bring you guys along my journey so that's basically what my videos are going to be about my journey during nursing school a few lifestyle videos um show my family a little bit but i really just made this channel for me so i can document my journey and just have something of my own you know so my name is raven if i did not mention that and i'm married i have three children and i'm on my way to nursing school so this semester i'm taking three classes i'm taking anatomy and physiology ethics and a cpr class so this is the first week of school so i'm going to do this what's in my book bag haul and make it quick because i do have class at 5 30 tonight so without further ado let's jump right in okay so i'm gonna show you guys my book bag this is my book bag it is the north face um jetster edition and it is in the color vintage white and rose gold so i'm gonna start off by saying this first this book bag is not good for nursing school whatsoever because it only has two compartments so i'm only using it for this last semester of classes for me so well i have the semester and a half but anyway i'm just using it for this class because i don't have any books really i just have a cpr manual a small chapter book for ethics and my anatomy and physiology class didn't give us a um, physical book we have an e-textbook so let me show you guys what I have so you can see I have this hair clip because my hair is braided and I like to keep it pulled back especially when I'm in labs and then I have this um, alarm thingy it has like a flashlight and a button to press since campus I have to walk to it so I park in a parking garage and I know it can get dark I just want to be safe I also have a taser I want to get a fun if you know what i mean i did get um, a certificate of um, firearm training for um, to get a fun so i have that i just haven't applied to um, get my concealed carry yet but when i do then i will get a firearm so now let's get into it so starting in this first compartment it's not that big literally it stops right there but as you can see, it's overflowing with stuff. I have post-it notes, the, um, just the plain ones. Then I have the line ones. And as I think about it, I don't have any books to really annotate or take notes. So it's kind of pointless to have right now, but I'm going to keep it for next semester. Face mask, Lysol spray, um, pair one of two glasses that I have. I have another pair. They're currently getting filled at the eye doctor ponytail holders gum then I have candy in here because I am a type 1 diabetic so whenever my blood sugar gets low you know I have something to run to just making sure my kids aren't up and then I also have hand sanitizer some lotion and I have some travel body spray so I'm going to put that all back in here and that was just the small compartment now this is the bigger compartment. This is what it looks like. So in here, I just have a study guide for anatomy and physiology. Um, a notebook that I don't even know if I'm going to be using or not. But it has three subjects because I'm only taking three classes. And I have a folder with my syllabus and everything that has been passed out so far. And then I got this pencil pouch from Amazon. It is expandable. If you carry a lot of things like me, this is a plus. It has a front compartment right here that nothing can fit because it is packed to capacity. And here I just have pencils right here. And then pens, some um, tabs for marking chapters, I guess. And then all my highlighters and the rest of my pins are in here too. Like, I am really over prepared for class, which is a good thing. But these are my pencils and pens. 
that I barely use because I use my iPad, which is right here. I have this iPad and my pencil that I read and I take notes on as well. I also have a digital planner on here as well. So when I don't bring in my physical planner, I'll put it on my iPad so that way I can go between the two. And then I also have this pencil, this pen thing for my Apple Pencil. And you know, as you saw, you click it and it goes up and you press it and the pencil come out. And then with my iPad, I have a case and it has a Bluetooth keyboard that I use to type if I'm not writing because my professor did state that she doesn't want any notes written, handwritten. She wants everything typed. And then I also have a mouse to go with that as well. And I think that this is the last thing. This is a Louis Vuitton um, makeup pouch dupe, I think. Got it off Etsy. Um, I just wanted it because it was big, but it wasn't big enough, apparently, because it is packed. But in here, I'll show you the chaos. This is like everything that I keep in here. Um, I got some toilet spray. Um, a Tide to go pen deodorant, tissues, cotton nail wipes, tampons, pads, toothpaste, Tylenol, mouthwash, toothbrush. And then I have all my diabetic supplies like my meter just in case my little CGM dies or whatever happens. I have a backup. And then I have a change infusion set, insulin pans, test strips. Um, needles, lancets, chapstick, and the little thing you poke your finger with. And I also have this emergency glucagon pen, just in case my pressure gets too low. And then that's everything that I carry in here. I'm gonna have to close this off camera because it's a lot. And then I have my water bottle. And that's pretty much everything I carry for class. Oops. That's everything I've carried for class. So, so far the semester is going good. My only easiest class was Monday, which was anatomy and physiology. And I believe that's the last day it's going to be easy because she was just going over um, the syllabus and what we can expect this year. So, today is another lecture day and I also have lab as well. So, and I don't think we'll be working on any cadavers this year. I'm going to ask the professor today when I go in because I really wanted to see it and touch and feel and all that stuff. But I'm okay if we don't. Um, I did order Atlas from Amazon so that way I can see the anatomy of everything in all the body parts pretty much. So, um, But I think I'm going to end this video here. Um, I will try and bring you guys along to class if I can. Um, like I said, um, I go to class at 5.30. It's 3.30 and I'm waiting on my husband to come home so that way he can take over daddy duty so I can go to class. But yeah, uh, thank you guys for watching this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will tune back in with you guys when I have more content to film. So, bye. bye.